Hello there viewers and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Ranger Shadows of Almia I am Huska Today we are starting our brand new journey here in the Almia region So without wasting too much time, let's jump into it Are you a boy or are you a girl? Please just choose I am going to play this game because In safe we have the background of Shadows of Almia so to know what happened in Almia region, we have to play this game. That's why I'm going to play this Let's Play. Draw looks around Pikachu and capture it. Okay. There you go. And capture it. Okay, good going. That's pretty impressive. Hey, hey, hey. My name, it is Kapwan. You are now a member of our secret army, the Instructable Team School. As proof of your membership, you are conferred the school style you just used. Together we shall rule the world. Oh please Mr. Kaplan. Please don't tease my students with a silly performance like that. Haha, <laughs> sorry sorry. The timing was just too perfect to miss. Um, congratulations. You have passed the Ranger Schools. Entrance exam with flying colors. That really was quite an impressive capture. Congratulations, you have been accepted. Starting today, you are officially a student of the Ranger School. I am Miss April. I am your class teacher. I am pleased to meet you. Your classmates are waiting for you. I shall show you to our class. Enjoy your school life. That's our school. There we go, Ranger. So logo. Sorry to keep you waiting, class. And good morning, everyone. Good morning. As I mentioned yesterday, we have a new member of for our class. Is it a guy or a girl? Which is it? Is the new student cute, cool, or look like a celebrity? Okay, that's enough. You can see for yourself. Here's our latest classmate. Come on in. Our new friend came alone to our Almia region to become a Pokemon Ranger. Oh yes, you should introduce yourself to our class rather than me. Let's start with your name. We didn't go with our usual name. Let's put it Sky. That's okay. Your name is Sky? Yes. Okay, our new friend is named Sky. Let's make him feel welcome. I understand that he scored quite well on our entrance exam. What is it, kid? Why the big queen? Anyway, we should better get you seated somewhere, Sky. You can have the seat next to Keith. Okay, that will do. That's it for treating you like a new transfer student. From now on, you're all my students. People who I can take pride in teaching. Let's do it everyone. Let's not fail your dreams of becoming rangers, operators and mechanics. Yeah. Okay. I shall change the class schedule especially for today. This is, will be a free study class. But before I go Sky, I need to explain something to you. It's about the school style you were provided before the entrance exam. It's a simplified version of a ranger's official capture style. Now put a simple a style in a device used for befriending and capturing Pokemon. By drawing loops around Pokemon, it conveys the ranger's feelings of friendship to the Pokemon. When the ranger's friendship is fully conveyed, the Pokemon is captured. Everyone, you should all be paying attention to this as a review. Touch the button at the bottom right of the touchscreen to open the menu. Okay. The upper screen shows your status and your styler level. On the lower screen, the styler menu is displayed. The style menu has many convenient features that you can access. You should try them out and see for yourself. Oh please Keith, don't yawn with your mouth wide open like that. Next the button at the bottom left of the touch screen. That's the change screen button for switching what that's what's shown on the top screen. You can switch between the map mode and the front Pokemon mode. They are both convenient, so you should set the mode to whichever you want you use most. Oh yes, there's something quite important. 
As a student of the Ranger School, you may have up to 3 Pokemon with you. If you capture a 4 Pokemon, you should have to release one of them. By release, I mean you should have to let it go with its goodbye to the Pokemon. If there is anything you don't understand, look it up in a glossary. Actually, that turned into quite a lesson. Are you a little overwhelmed? Really, you should just try things out and see how they work for yourself. After all, nothing beats experience, it's all about trying. Redmi, can I get you to show Sky around the school please? I sure will. I shall be in the staff room. I have I I shall leave you to it. You are gathered around us. Hey new kid, I forgot your name, but how long did it take you to capture a Pikachu? Like an hour? Kid just a show off. You are better off ignoring him. Instead of should be paying attention to me. I am not here to become a ranger. I want to become an operator instead. So when Kid becomes a ranger, I can order him around like my servant. Just joking. Alright, let me take you on a tour of the ranger school. Let's begin with our own classroom. We have already met our teacher, Miss April. She is really nice, but if you make her mad, look out. There is another class next to us. The teacher there is Mr. Kinker. He is very uptight and strict. No running in the hallway. He is like his pet say. That thing floating there is a save machine. That machine keeps a record of all your achievements as a ranger. Besides, there you can find save machines in town and forest too. If you spot one, you should check it out. Okay, let's move on. We shall explore the school building. Sure, but firstly, as you can see, I'm going to save some data. There we go. Now let's go. Let's check around the King Kids classroom. Sorry to disturb you. I am taking our new classmate on a tour of the school. This is the other class. The man looking this way is Mr. Kinkier. He gets his hair to go that way with a ton of hairspray. He is a little uptight, too uptight I think. I am not a big fan. Okay then let's go out. If he is too much uptight. Oh there are two ways. This is the library. Also known as Keith's nap room. That boy in the back with a haircut like a mushroom is Isaac. He is awesomely smart, you can usually find him right here in the library. Sometimes he goes off somewhere though. Okay. Another room. Here is the staff room. But usually only our principal is here. Our principal is Mr. Lamont. His eyes are always twinkling happily behind his glasses. I like him pretty well. Mr. Kinkier's lab is down there, but we are not allowed down there without permission. Let's go upstairs. Our dorms are on the second floor. This is where we all bunk down, cold style, not in the same bedrooms of course. The boy's bedroom is on the left and the girl's bedroom is on the right. Janice, the lady there, is our caretaker. She is like a mom to us all. That's a recharge machine. It's for recharging your styler to full. Ding dong ding dong. There goes the bell. We can go outside now. That small building is the training room. That's where Mr. Kaplan will teach you about performing captures. Miss Claire is also there. She teaches about clearing targets. The big clearing over there is where we practice doing target clears. That reminds me. Do you know about clearing targets? The expression tells me you don't know. Well, that's alright. That's why we have the training room. Okay, then let's go to the training room. Mr. Kaplan and Ms. Claire, can you give us special lessons, please? <laughs> Welcome to the Instructable Team School Secret Hideout. Yes, yes, we have heard that before. Let's pay no attention to Mr. Kaplan and his make believe conspiracy. Oh, please don't ignore me. I shall be serious and introduce myself. Um, my name is Mr. Kaplan. I teach the fundamentals of capture. And I'm Miss Claire. Glad to meet you. It's my job to teach you about performing target players. I know you had to do a capture for your entrance exam, but I think you should learn about capturing properly once more. Mr. Kaplan, can you give Sky a lesson on capturing, please? That's an admirable attitude. Okay, I shall give you a special lesson. The fundamentals of captures. 
Let's start with the basics of capture. Touch the screen with your Nintendo DS stylus. The capture disk appears. Now slide the stylus on the touch screen and draw a line with the capture disk. Extend this capture line and draw loops around the target Pokemon. At loops are drawn, the range's feelings of friendship are conveyed to the Pokemon. At drawing loops, the guard under the Pokemon gradually fills up. When the guard is full, the capture is success. However, the target Pokemon doesn't retain the ranger's feelings of friendship. If the capture is incompleted, the guard goes down over time. It looks like this. Next, let me explain about the capture starter energy. At the bottom of the touch screen is the Styler Energy Guard. If the capture disc or capture line is hit by a Pokemon's attack, the Styler Energy is reduced. See what happens when Pichu uses its attack mode. If the Styler runs out of energy, there is nothing you can do about it. It's what we call Kemo. That's why if your styler is low on energy, it's not a bad idea to abandon the capture and flee the scene. To run away, touch the flee button at the bottom left of the touchscreen. That about does it for the basics of a Pokemon capture using a styler. If you need a refresher lesson, don't hesitate to come and see me. Thank you Mr. Kaplan. Next we shall finally learn what we mean by target clear. Is clear? Please give Sky a lesson about performing a target clear. Very well, this will be a special lesson. We shall learn about the basics of performing a target clear. First touch the wooden crate. On the upper screen the field move needed to clear it is indicated. This crate needs the field move crush to clear. Do you see the number 1 besides crush? That indicates the required level of power. A Pokemon that has the field move crush and with a power rating of 1, that Pokemon would be Beedoof for example. Here we have a Beedoof I should capture earlier. Touch the Beedoof. The upper screen shows that Beedoof's field move is crushed and its power is 1. Next, draw a line from the Beedoof to the target. If the Pokemon's field move matches the target, you will be asked yes or no. The trade shatter into the pieces. When the target is clear, the helping Pokemon runs off. It will return to whenever, wherever it was originally captured. You must match the field move to the target, crush won't always work. When you see a target, you always need to confirm what field move to use. That's how a target clear works. If you would like a review, please come see me whenever you like. Thank you very much Miss Claire. Now you know all about captures and how to do a target clear. You are all set. Let's go back to the school yard. There's another place I want to see you. Oh dear, oh dear, help someone, anyone, catch the Beedoof for me. Janice, she's having trouble with the Beedoof. Please, guy, capture the Beedoof and get them to settle down. Hey, I was wondering that what the Rukus was all about. Looks like a good time that's up for it, grabs. Keith, don't just stand there, you help with captures too. It won't be much fun, just I help. Hey, new kid, I forgot your name, but I challenge you. We shall have to capture Grace, you and me. We shall see how, who can capture the most beautiful fight. Can't you make the effort to learn our classmates name? You can be so annoying kid. Go ahead and you, your silly race or whatever, but hurry up. Okay, let's get on with it. 3, 2, 1, start. Thank you. 
down here. Okay, the competition is over. That's all the beat of now. I caught five. That means you caught four. That means victory is mine. You and Keith look good at it too. Of course, I also need to thank our new friend and Pridhmi too. Thank you all for this. This is a big relief for me. And to the leader Bidu, I am so sorry. I really didn't mean to tread on your tail. I shall make it up to you with tastier treats that usual. Come along, everyone. I shall rate your captures around 65 out of 100. Hey, but you know, I shall be honest. I was pretty surprised by how you did. You might be. Decent for someone who just learned about this. You said your name is Kyle, right? Oh, you kid. You knew our friend's name all along. For goodness sake. Oh, that's right. There's somewhere I haven't shown you. Go. What you mean? Ascension Square? Yes. Then I shall go too. Alright. I guess we shall let you come with us. To get to Ascension Square, you go to the east of the schoolyard. Then you, go to, you turn south to the stairs that go down to the square. Okay, let's go. There's a Pokemon around there. There's a block way. You can't go there. No problem. So, Badu, Taylor. To get to the Assassin's Square, you go to the east of the schoolyard. Then you turn south to the stairs that go down to the square. Okay, here we go. The stairs. This is Assassin's Square. Next month there is going to be a special class here. It's the outdoor class. That monument there is called the Flex Stone. If you make a firm pledge to each other with your friends here, it will surely come true. That's what Principal Lyman told me. And there you have it. That concludes Rhythm School Tour of Wonder and Excitement. Sky, I'm glad to have met you. I hope we can be friends for a long time. Hey, told, hold it now. Don't worry about Rhythmy. Be friends with me, okay? Oh, it's ding dong, ding dong. Oh, there we goes the bell. We should better get back to the class. Oh boy, oh boy, kid. Aren't you the sleek one? That night. Sky, are you the kind of guy who writes letter? I'm adding to my parents about you, actually. Huh? You already wrote to your little sister about today? Like how I beat you in our capture race? Hey Sky, you are not sleepy yet, are you? Come over here. Alright, I brought him. Everything's ready. Okay, let's get started with our test of courage to welcome Sky. Keep in town, but yeah. We just want you to prove you are brave. I had to do it before too. It's good. But you know, you do have that easily spooked look to you. No offense. The rules are simple. The four of us have hidden our silos in four different places in the school. They are Miss Prince April's class, Mr. Kinkett's class, the staff room and the library. Gather all four stylists then put them in front of the door to the basement room. It's not hard or anything but it's also not safe to go alone. That's why we have always had this one rule. The student seated next to the initiate has to go to. Ah, you mean me? Okay, you two. Off you go. Let's go, but not now. We are going... Not now, actually. We are going to go to collect the stylers in the next episode. Thank you guys for watching this video of Rangers Shadows of Almia. If you have any tips, any comments about our future journey, let me know. If you like this video, then press that like button. And if you are new to my channel, click the subscribe button and enjoy this let's play. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next episode. Goodbye.